Okay, at this point, we're going to be talking about modules, and they're really a great way of creating your first uh, Canvas website. Uh, it's a fantastic tool. It's, it gives you the ability to make your students complete one aspect or chapter or subject matter before they move on to the next one. And a lot of teachers I know think that that's really a, a terrific feature to have. So we're going to go ahead and create a module. The first thing you have to do is find the course that you want to add a module to. So for example, if I went to uh, Joseph Grappi practice course and I click on that, um, you're going to notice I already have course modules right in front of me and I created them and the students as you can see prerequisites the seven years war they're not allowed they have to do whatever's in this module before they can move on to the next module so for example um, in this assignment it's a discussion and I'll show you how to add to discussions um, and people can reply was it really seven years? And then after they reply, then they can move on to the next one. Okay, getting back to the modules. How do we add another module? What you're going to do is you're going to go, make sure you click on modules to, your, to the left hand side here. Then I want you to click create a module. And the name of it will say You'll notice you can lock the module until a specific date and time. Before they can preview this module, if you want, we can add a prerequisite. And also, remember to check students move through the requirements in this module in sequential order. So they have to um, make sure and before they move on to the next one, they have to get the one done before it. So let's go ahead and add prerequisite. And what I'm going to do is, what's the prerequisite for, for them to get to the new module? Um, the Spanish-American War was right above it, so let's use that one. And then I'll click Add Module. Okay, so here we are, um, and you'll notice that the prerequisite is the Spanish-American War. Prerequisite for this module is the Seven Years' War. At this point, if I wanted to add more content, um, you would click on that wheel and then you'd click add content. From here you can add assignments, quizzes, a content page. A content page is, is basically an information page. So for example if I click on content page um, and I click new page I'll say facts about Alexander then I'll click add item okay so now from here I can edit this if I click on facts about Alexander and I say edit this page You'll notice up here you have full editing capabilities. Remember, this is just content. Um, you have the ability to insert tables, uh, indent, all your basic um, word processing skills you have here. You can add a picture. You can add a hyperlink. You'll notice here you can actually record media. So if, you, if I clicked that, your webcam would come on and you can actually record. So from here, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click Save Changes. And that's how I've added more content to my module. And you'll notice that it will, it will be located in Pages. So if we go back to Modules again, now you know how, now you, now you can understand how we added content.
This was a discussion. If I wanted to delete a module or something in the module, you would just hit that X. 